Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Please, can you hear me? Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Dickens, Dickin, yes, please open for us in prayer, sir. Father, in the name of Jesus. Amen. We thank you. We bless your holy name for another wonderful day like this. Father, Amen. we pray the Lord Almighty that everything we are going to do tonight, so God, we find the power of the of your Holy Spirit to come and take control in the name of Jesus. Amen. Prayer, oh God Almighty, whatever prayer, whatever word we are going to hear, oh God, Father, Lord, we pray the God you take preeminent in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. And upon the God Almighty, let there be testimony in our life tonight in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. I will thank you, we bless your holy name. For in Jesus' mighty name we have prayed. Amen. Amen. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. Oh, I can see this is a blessing. Ma, can you hear me? I can hear you, ma. Uh, lead us in some praises. <laughs> <laughs> Ma'am, come in. You have to you have to come to come I want to see who is leading us. <laughs> Are you not ready? <laughs> yeah, do that fast because uh, we have a lot ahead of us, please. <laughs> Thank you, Jesus. You are the owner of my soul. Alpha and Omega. In our generation, there is no one like you. Alpha and Omega, you are worthy to be praised. Thank you, Jesus. You are the owner of my soul. I found no man to be praised. There is no you are worthy to be praised, amen, Lord Jesus. You, you are, are worthy to be, to be praised, amen. What shall I render? What shall what I render? What shall I render to you, oh Lord? I will, I will praise your name. I shall shout at What shall I render to you, oh Lord? What shall I render? What shall I render? What shall I render to you? I will praise your name. I shall praise you. What shall I render to you? Oh Lord, Jesus, the big man. Jesus, 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 you are worthy of our praise. You are worthy of our praise. Come and see what the Lord has done for me. Come and see. What the Lord has done for me? Come and see what the Lord 
no bad song for me. Let me to be loved. I will leave it. I must see what I know that do for me. I must see what I know that do for me. Somebody, why do that song for me? It was to be mine. I will leave it. Thy most tyrant, thy most tyrant, the most tyrant of us today. The most tyrant, the most tyrant. There is a melody in my heart today. There is a melody in my heart today. Praise Master Jesus. Hallelujah. Amen. 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 Please let's open the Bible. Let's open up the word. Amen. Please, the book of Mark chapter 5. Mark chapter 5 from verse 25. Mark chapter 5. From verse 25. And a certain woman which had an issue with... Okay. And a certain woman which had an issue of blood 12 years... Just 25. Continue. Okay. And had suffered many things of many physicals and had spent all that she had and was nothing better, but rather grew worse. This is I want to mark that place. He said, rather grew worse, which is a story we are reading is a story of the blood woman. 
The Bible recorded that for 12 good years, this woman has suffered an affliction. And I don't think any of us, our situation is up to 12, when it's up to 12, but look at what God did with our life. Say, I suffered this affliction for 12 years, continuous blood dropping from this woman's body. Please, let's continue. Okay, 27. When she had heard of Jesus, came in the prayer, uh, pray when you have heard of Jesus, came in place behind and touched his garments. 28. For she said, if I may touch but his, his clothes, I shall be whole. Mm -hmm. Continue. Okay, 29. And straightway, the fountain of her blood was dried up, and she felt in her body that she was healed of that plague. Okay. 20. 30 and Jesus immediately knowing in himself that virtual had gone out of him, turned him about in, in the press and said, Who touched my clothes? Mm -hmm. 21. And this disciple said unto him, Thou said the multitude, join thee, and say, sayest thou, Who touched me? Okay, 30. let's move to verse 34. Okay, and he, said unto her, and he said unto her, Daughter, thy faith hath made thee whole. Go in peace and be whole of the plague. Plague, praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Once yes. again, I welcome you to the season of double portion. Amen. Hallelujah. Yes. Double portion concerning the miracle, double portion concerning that blessing, that breakthrough you are expecting from God. And I decree, I declare you will not be left out this season in Jesus' name. Amen. I said you will not be left out this season in the name of Jesus. Amen. If God has done it before, he said you to do it again. The Bible said Jesus Christ, the same yesterday, today, and forever. So if he has not changed previously, it is not your time we will change. In fact, if God has ever done miracles, blessing, this is a time he's doing greater ones. Have you not heard of greater blessings and miracles God is doing? So that goes, goes to give you a conviction. If you can do it for others also, it will be your turn now in the name of Jesus. Amen. You will not be left out in Jesus' name. You will Amen. not be last on the line, but rather you are next in line for the miracle in the name of Jesus. Amen. You are next in line for the miracle in the name of Jesus. Amen. You see the most high changing your case. I said the God of favor coming around, giving your own favor in the name of Jesus. Amen. Giving you a new song. I see Amen. a new dawn, a new era in your life in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. Oh Lord, hallelujah. Coming Amen. back to the story we read, we're just going to visit a little while we launch into prayer seriously this evening because this is a season of prayers. This is in our prayers. And when we are expecting from, from God, what do we do? We pray. That is why the Bible says, ask and it shall be given. The process of asking is the process of prayers. And that is why these 21 days are set aside for you and I to dwell in his presence. You know, today I was ministering the church at the airport. I made them to understand by the help of the Holy Spirit that one way your passing can be successful is that set a goal, have a target. Have you ever considered taking upon yourself and say, what am I even doing this fasting? Are you fasting because the pastor has said we should fast? Or the wife has said we should? It's every year we go on we are fasting and prayer. Either we go on 21 days or 30 days or 40 days as free. Days. So let me just join them to fast. No, that should be entirely, not totally a good motive. Though it's good, but it's not good enough. But you should have a personal reason for yourself. It is when you have a personal reason, that is when God will meet you at the point of darkness. And when the need comes, you can actually say, I fasted, look at my result. And I made them to understand through the scriptures. We have people that fasted, they went on for a purpose. And look at the story of Esther. We saw Esther today. She was favored because she had, uh, because she had a goal. What was that goal is that she should be favored. And she had that goal and she, that goal was accomplished. We didn't have the time to look at Jehoshaphat. Jehoshaphat, Second Chronicles chapter 20. He had a goal that he, that he had the news that the enemy is going to destroy them. But his goal was that God should come and help. And he went to fasting with the whole people of Judah and God granted them their heart's uh, desire. 
You go again to the book of Jonah. The people of Nineveh and the king of Nineveh are asked these people to go on fasting because they wanted to have mercy from God and to save them from the destruction that God was bringing to them because the land was full of evil. They went on fasting and prayer and God had them. And also, I believe if that same God have had them in the previous time, that same God is around to answer us in Living Faith International Ministries in the name of Jesus. That mm -hmm. same God is around to answer you right there where you are hearing me from in the name of Jesus. God mm -hmm. bless you. If I were to be you, I, if we don't have a target, I will encourage you to begin to write out your target. What do you want God to do for you? It's very, very essential. You are not asking too much. It's your right. Why? Because you, are, you have a father. You have a father. Just as I have children. When my children ask me something that is their right, is their right, I should give, the, give it to them. I don't expect my children to be in need as a parent. I will not meet that need and I'll expect them to get it from somewhere else. So also we have a father, it's your right. So don't be afraid to write on the piece of paper, you know, or on the back of your mind, say, this is what I want God to do for me this season. And you will not be left out in Jesus' name. Amen, praise the Lord. So quickly tonight, I want to encourage, exhort us on what I titled, don't give up. Don't give up. I mean, to tell yourself, Call yourself by your name and say, I dare you what, don't give up. Mm. I wonder somebody, I want to hear you saying it. Pastor Abby, don't give up. I want to hear you call yourself by your name. Don't give up. Pastor Abby, don't give up. Don't give up. Don't give up. Don't give up. Say to yourself again, it is not over until it's over. It is not over until it's over. It is not over until it's over. It, it is, is not over until it's over. See, I want to encourage you tonight. I don't know how many that put you down. I don't know how they have, they have written you off. I don't know how they might have concluded concerning your case. Just as the story we read concerning this blood woman. They have written a half, they have concluded concerning her case. Why do I say so? Do you see anywhere written it where we read the story concerning her, that there was an effort from anywhere? Nobody. You want to tell me that this woman didn't have a relative? She didn't fall from the blues. She didn't fall from the sky. A mother gave back to her. Okay, let's agree. The mother, maybe she has lost her parents because of age or whatsoever thing. Which is you have a brain, not that she, it, let's say she don't even have a, a have some siblings. Anyone, maybe it's only her that parents get back. To. What about cousins? What about aunties? What about uncles? But perhaps because of her bloody condition, they decided to abandon her. I said, you're not too much step. We don't leave you. We don't feel happy again. But this woman never gave up on sign herself. That is my encouragement concerning you. Please don't write yourself off. Don't give up. Don't give up concerning that situation. It is not over. It is not the end of the show. This woman was determined. She was focused. She made up her mind and said, no, I am not going to give up until I get a solution. Is it, you think you are the only one that has been rough and old? You think you are the only one that passed through stress and trials concerning people? I've had people say that, well, you know, churches matter, don't tire me. Now, I'm not even going to go to church. You can't just stay in my house. That is not an excuse. Uh, pastors, too, they do what I do, not to the play. Why we not come know the right pastor again? Now, maybe all these pastors say, I'm not going to believe anyone. That is not an excuse. This woman, if she, the way we read, remember when we read, Vex 20, uh, 26 specifically said that uh, she has suffered many things from different daughters. From many daughters. So the Bible, they actually mention how many. You know, when the Bible said many, indeed, they were many. But this woman never gave up. Okay? She has given no concern her situation. She had every right to stay back at her home. And nobody would tell her that she has not tried. The Bible said not only has she visited from physician to physician, different daughters, she spent all that she had. She has spent all that. She, I don't know the wala you have gone to. The essence you have gone to for you to get solution and solution is not forthcoming. But let's learn from the example of this woman. That is what the Bible is all about. It's a way to learn from those that have been ahead of us. The Bible said this woman, she went ahead and she was determined. She was focused and said, I must get my solution. I want to see somebody being determined today and say, I must get my document. In this land, Italy, I must get my document. I don't know I guess how it's going to take me, how it's going to happen. I must get married, whether the devil likes it or not. Hey, yes, I must get my own spouse as a man or a woman. I have not been pregnant as a mother. I, yes, I must carry my own children. I don't know whatsoever it might be your own desire. I've been in rent touch for long. I said, no, enough is enough. I must, yes, have my own, my own as written on the contract, my own name. I have been moving from people to people, taking me to work. No, this is time for me to have my own job. You know your situation better than, than I do. This woman had every excuse to give up. She never gave up. She made up her mind and said, I will make a difference. 
And really, she made the difference. That is why her story was written in the Bible. Search the Bible very well. God does not have time for people that are not serious about their situation or people that, that they don't want to rise or make a difference. If you search the Bible very well, people that their stories were written in the Bible, carefully analyzed, most of the time, these were people that made a difference. People that had challenges. People that refused to take no for an answer. People that were determined. You think you are the only one that will be suffering. You are not the only one because the next neighbor have not told you his or story. But perhaps if they open their mouth, you will, show, you will even say, maybe like say, my own better part. I used to say that, well, no matter what I when you want, why we tell them big no matter what you want, why we tell them big For those that does not understand me, you will not talk to your comma. Now we say, no, get to the bottom. Now we say, no, get in your challenge. It gets. May I just look and say, no need to come to talk up and down. May I just keep quiet. So at times when you over, you, you know, you always announce that they get this one. Today, this one, they suffer for this one. This one, they suffer for this one. And also, I don't let that, you know, some people blow out of purple and begin to angry and say, I've been suffering. Nobody called me. Nobody did this one. Nobody did this one. The first way you the way you the uh, uh, angry about because he not tell you, you know. If the person go up and tell you, you go discover at the end of the day, your condition even feel better past that, that person. You know. Look at this, you watch, she took it upon herself. And at the end of the day, how did she get solution? She got solution through the master Jesus. She got solution. That is what I'm my encouragement to you tonight, that you are, you are in the right place. You have not come up to meet me. You have not come out to meet Reverend Wale. You have not come out to meet Living and Shaman Street. You have come to meet Jehovah God, the Lord Jesus. The Lord Jesus, like the master of solution of all. The, the woman never gave up and was finally, see, a decision to about life is that if you will not give up, one day be one day, your solution will reach your hand. That is the truth. People feel you do your year, they feel you play ball. One day be one day, that way they look for go become your own. And I see you not be left out in Jesus' name. I declare, I declare to not receive that miracle in Jesus' name. Amen. That document is yours in the name of Jesus. Amen. I command that womb to be open in Jesus' name. Amen. I command, yes, that favor to begin to locate you tonight in the name of Jesus. Finally, this woman got her answer. She came in contact with the master Jesus. And look at, she got her own answer. She didn't stay back at home and she got her answer. She asked to find her way to the master. And on her weak body, oh, one and notice, so. Oh, not that this woman, she was perfect on her. She was totally weak. We are women. Most of us are women here. Yeah. If you are on your mess, uh, you know, on your monthly flow, you don't know as they be. Some people cannot even get up because of pains. So, no, 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 this woman, every day, blood drop out of her body. For good to have yet, this woman certainly should have been very, very weak. But in her weakness, she pressed past the crowd. Look at what the Bible said. It was crowd. People were men that were countering around Jesus. This leads me to the point that I want to make tonight also. That have you ever asked your question, why are you yourself question, why are you following Jesus? Are you just going to church because others are going gathering on this platform because you know it's just for gathering's sake? The people we are they were following Jesus, but most of them didn't know why they were following Jesus. It was only this woman that was at the rear behind that knew what she was after. She had a goal, she had a target, and her target was accomplished. She didn't care how what they were saying, who was smashing her, who was pushing her. I wonder, you know, just vision how the story would be where before this woman could get to Jesus. We gotta go, this woman will go push her. She might have that before, she might fall in several times, you know, several times because her body was weak. People were stronger than her. She could see man is stronger, get up. Say, ah, today be today, I must reach this man. This man will pass me by. Today night, today, that's how she was struggling. That's how she was struggling. I don't, and you know, that is how maybe some of us were struggling through this fasting period. Don't worry. Your body might be weak. You might be tired. Sickness might come along the way. All to just to frustrate your plan for you not to accomplish this 21 days. I tell you, be time, be focused. Be focused, make up your mind and say enough is enough. I refuse to continue to take nonsense. I refuse to I continue to swallow nonsense. You know, people will be said that they continue to swallow nonsense, go ahead, they tell love for nonsense. Because people will refuse to take no for an answer. We refuse to fight. Where be say, you know, one fight, make it make it way out. If you make up your mind, say, I will fight, go get time. When people where they give you food, time go reach, be say, you go quick on the feed yourself, they don't need to give you food again. People are somebody put you for a time or say, now you go come and get your own as you call, you were able to fight. This woman was able to fight her way to Jesus. Finally, she touched the aim of Jesus' garment. And how would, how would this woman that affect in her body? Or you know, the Bible says he started receiving in the bed. How the great judge she would affect in her heart and say, Finally, I accomplished my purpose. And you know, I accomplished finally my vision is being realized. 
after 12 good years, after 12 good years of suffering, being, you know, played up and down, being, being, being talked down on, being looked down on. Those are not supposed to look down on me, mess me up, they have messed me up. Finally, this woman realized a miracle. See, God will not come down and give you that miracle you desire. He wants to see how long you have longed for that miracle. That will see your mind towards that miracle. Are you hunger for it? Jesus didn't go to this woman's house to go and deliver the miracle. It was that woman that sought after Jesus. It was that woman that sought after Jesus in her weakness, in her lackness, you know, in a in, in, in a depressed state. She was nobody, but she went after Jesus. I don't know where you are expecting your miracle from. It is only the master that is the way. This woman had every other alternatives. In fact, she has tried. But finally, she knew that it is only Jesus. So this 21 days, have it at the back of your mind. This 21 days is not going to pass me by. Enough is enough. Lord, until you grant me my miracle, I let you, I will not let you go. Esther said, where we read today, Esther chapter 4, verse 16. He said, if I perish, I perish. Jacob said in, in Genesis chapter 32, he said, I, I will not let you go except you bless me. God is looking for those that will stand on wrong get faith. I will not let you go or let you bless me. You ask me a question and say, suppose it, uh, uh, during these 21 days, I do not get my miracle. Or uh, after these 21 days, I should not get my miracle. I uh, should I uh, come to the conclusion? No, it's not for you to come to the conclusion. The issue, where, the, the way God is doing it is mostly at times, not be where you pray your miracle, not be you the receiver. More. At times, if you be said some miracle, what me and you they enjoy today, some blessing. Now, the one who don't pray maybe last year, two years ago, three years ago, now God, they walk on our hand and now we the sinner. The one way they do now, it might be that it will be six months and if it's the same miracle. It might be yes at the this uh, ending of this year. It might be next year as a result of this prayer you are praying. Prayer is like a seed sown on the farm. As you're going to need to sow that seed. And as you sow this seed, and as you're going to water, you how do you water prayer? You water prayer by praying. As you are praying again and again, you are watering that, those seeds. Finally, those still become from level to one level to another, begin to grow and comes to a few maturity of fruits. And you are able to eat and satisfy. That is our prayer is. So please don't give up. Be encouraged. Be encouraged. Never be deceived that God does not answer prayer. So if you are not serious, that doesn't mean he has not answered. He has answered. There are devil, de different levels of prayers. Yours might be on the waiting list. A time will come that you will smile and say, finally. You know, those days in Nigeria, I will end with this. Those days in Nigeria. You remember that most of all we wrote Waek, we wrote uh, John. The day when you write Waek, then you just see the results. The day when you write your uh, this year, uh, your uh, school sat after you have finished uh, SSC that those uh, time, now you the see results. No, oh just SSC series. Oh, no. so some of us will not really uh, finish at least just SSC and then the see because this is the first put us for long vacation. They say, I know with the wait, I wait till result. We go, they wait, wait, wait. You don't write the exam, I'll be your never right. You don't write. You are waiting for result. That is how some of our prayer, fasting and prayers are. You are praying today, you are, you are writing your exam. A time will come, that result will come. But those example I made uh, just now, people will not write the exam, that's the way you write your exam. Your friend will not write the exam, so they wait for result, you go wait for result. You don't get any cost to wait for result because he's not right. So, so this time of fasting and prayer, there are some people that will take it for granted that will not take it serious. So wait with the rest of all the way for results, not get any cost to wait for results. And when our results come, we believe it that it will be successful in Jesus' name. So I don't get any cost to, you know, to query God, say, you know, you know, give out the result where you want, because what others were writing, he was busy doing another thing. So we're going to be praying tonight. So God be the glory in Jesus' name. Amen. Mm -hmm. Our Father in heaven, we glorify your name. We bow down before you, a Father in heaven. Glorify your name. We bow down before you, a Father in heaven. We glorify your holy name. We bow down before you, Father. In heaven, glorify your name. We bow down before you. Amen, amen. Blessings and glory. Where something's given. In on Power and mind. Bellows to the Lord. Forever and ever, amen. 
Amen, 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 amen. Black saints and glory, where songs is careful. Hey, oh, power and might, well, oh, so Lord, forever and ever. Amen. Please repeat after me. Say, my father, my father. My father, my father. My father, my father. My father, my father. Give me the grace never to give up. Give me the grace never to give up. Open your mouth and begin to pray. Prophesy to yourself. I want to hear you pray. The grace never to give up. Open your mouth and pray. I refuse to give up. 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 Concerning that situation in the name of Jesus. Why? Because I believe you will answer me, Lord. You will answer me, Lord. You will answer me, Lord. Rama soto ya dada ba. Malake deke 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 soto. Lord, I refuse to give up. 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 You will answer me this day in the name of Jesus Christ. You will answer me this day in the name of Jesus Christ. Rama soto ye kela soto, ye kela 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 soto, ragana kela kela soto, ragana kela kela soto, ragana kela soto, henda ba kela soto, rabina ba ira kela sende, masuda ala kabakuzene ye kela kela soto, ragana kela soto, rama kela soto. I refuse to give up, Lord. I refuse to give up more in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. I refuse to give up. I refuse to give up. I refuse to give up. In the name of Jesus Christ. Concerning that case, I refuse to give up. Concerning that case, I refuse to give up. Open your mouth and talk to God. You know the area. Yes, you want God to intervene in your life. Talk to God concerning that. He called that in by his, your, by his name. I say concerning this area, Lord, I refuse to give up. I refuse to give up. I refuse to give up. Rabba Kosoto concerning me this not written of Lord. It is not written of Lord God. Oh, do you say it is over Lord God, King of Lord? Then I believe it is over. In a first as you have not told me it is over, I refuse to go King of Lord to conclude it is over. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. In Jesus, then we are praying. Amen. You see, one of the ways we give up is, this, is discouragement. We are going to come and get every spirit of discouragement concerning that area. You know what is discouragement? No, that's some piece of our life. When you look at you, only you go bring say, hmm. All your man say, hey, road day yes, so this one will work so then you go ask yourself, say, if you go really work, how long? I don't believe God tired. And they make we so see the more we pray. The tea still remain the same. That is discouragement walking inside of you. And you know, when somebody is discouraged, there is nothing you can do. People encourage us, and we are encouraged because the first encouragement starts from we as individuals. So I want to also pray a bit after me. Say, my father, my father. My father, my father. My father, my father. My father, my father. My father. My father. By the authority in the name of Jesus. By the authority in the name of Jesus. I pray against every spirit of discouragement. I come against I walk come against the spirit of discouragement. In my life, in the name of Jesus. In my life, in the name of Jesus. Open your mouth and begin to come against every spirit of discouragement. Rama Soto. La Baba da Baba Soto. I refuse to be discouraged. The woman, Lord God, we read the Bible to your word, God. Jehovah, the Lord, woman. Jehovah, she was not discouraged. If she was to be discouraged, she got king of death. She would not have found her way to you, Lord. My God, king of death, she would have locked herself in her room, Lord God. My father in the house, Lord. My father, she was living, Lord God, king of death. Yes, there is a way. And so I Pray, greater grace and that one that walk upon that woman of my life. I refuse to be discouraged. 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 In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, every spirit of discouragement I chase out of my life. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, every spirit of God, King of God, walking like a giant outside, but inside me, not talking to us, a defeated foe. I come against the name of Jesus Christ. I refuse to be discouraged. Father, Lord, go into vain. Lord, go into vain. Lord, go into vain. In the name of Jesus Christ. In Jesus' name.
Amen. In the name of Jesus. Another way we can give up is what settling for less. What do I mean by settling for less? You don't give up because I that you never withdraw. But you say, mm, I go say that so go be I am taken like that. Those are the issue we record I need this woman. This woman, she had every cause to so say, eh, okay, make the blood they flow. Eh, so far, eh, make with the take that just that for us. Make it they flow now. You know, she settled for less. Now you are close to the miracle. You know, say this not, not be the blessed way they expect from God. But as you just see someone say, make I got people taken like that. So we're going to pray and say, God, I refuse to settle for less in Jesus' name. Mm -hmm. I must get the best. Yes, yeah, the best of my expectation must be met. Repeat mm -hmm. after me. Say, my father, my father. My father, my father. My father. I refuse to settle for less. I refuse, I refuse, I refuse to settle for I less. I refuse to settle for less in the name of Jesus. Open your mouth and begin to pray. I refuse. It is what God yeah, you said that He will do. In the name of Jesus Christ. If you are saying to Him, I say, Father, I refuse to settle for less. I refuse to go for second place. When you know you are supposed to be the first, you have to be your, your, your own husband. And by the time you are saying, I choose to settle as a second wife. Can you say you are settling for less? Oh, my son, so I take her like that. Oh, you are settling for less. So we can go put your mouth and say, I refuse to settle for less. And this sickness is not really good. And there's a commandment I can do to dead drug. So I can do, you are settling for less. Open your mouth and begin to pray. I refuse to settle for less. I refuse to settle for less. The best is my portion. The best is my portion. Why? Because I saw the God years that of it that can stretch the best. Of eight years that is not of every good and perfect thing. And so therefore, I refuse. I refuse to settle for less. I refuse to settle for less than the name of Jesus Christ. I refuse to settle for less than the name of Jesus Christ. I refuse to settle for less than the name of Jesus Christ. Yes, God, King of God, I must get to God to that place you have made there for me. I must get to that place you have made there for me. In the battle of the name of Jesus Christ, Rabba Soto, Lebo Boda Daba Soto, by your power, Lord, I refuse to settle for less. I refuse to settle for less. I refuse to settle for less, God. In the name of Jesus Christ, Rabba Soto, Yekalba Soto, Lebo Boda Daba in the name of Jesus, I tell you, my people, most of the most of the affliction we go to, it is not really by us because there are something that will be done against us. Look mm. at the issue of this woman. The Bible said that for 12 good years, something might have wrong, went wrong somewhere. I don't care whatsoever you are suffering, something went wrong, so we want to pray. I'm going to repeat after me. Say, my father, my father. My father, my father. Trouble them that trouble me. Trouble them that trouble me. Trouble them that trouble me. Trouble, trouble them that trouble me. Trouble 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 them that trouble me. Honor of evil will carry your load. Honor of evil will carry your load. Open your mouth and begin to pray. In the name of Jesus Christ. Trouble death that trouble me, Lord. Trouble death that trouble me, Lord. Wherever this affliction is coming from, back to sender. Back to sender. Back to sender. Yes, God King of Life. No, this is not your will for me. Not God King of Life. No, your desire. No, God King of Glory. Yes, God for me. In the name of Jesus Christ. Trouble death that trouble me, Lord. King of Glory. Jehovah. Yes, God King of Glory. That made up their mind to say, Lord, keep up the offering. That made up their mind that they were so big about us. Lord, God, spare them not to go. Lord, spare them not to go. Because in as much as you need to spare them, they need to leave Lord God, keep up to practice evil. Oh, God, the Bible says, No angel with hands, we can shall not go on punish. Now, Lord God, King of the rich of over. Yes, 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 God, King of the rich of over. Let them begin to repeat in the name of Jesus Christ. Let them begin to repeat on the phone in the name of Jesus Christ. Lord, spread them up. Lord, spread them up. Lord, spread them up. Lord, spread them up. Trouble them that trouble me, Lord. Trouble them that trouble me, Lord. Trouble them that trouble me, Lord. In the name of Jesus Christ. Rabakosoto. Legedevosoto. Regedegedevosoto. Maliegedegedevosoto. Rakatakalmasoto. Regedegedevosoto. Rakatakalmasoto. Trouble them that trouble me, Lord. Trouble them that trouble me, Lord. Lord, trouble them that trouble me, Lord. And on the name of Jesus Christ, and on the name of Jesus Christ, Rabba Kosoto, in Jesus' name. In the name of Jesus. Hey, some of us like we don't understand this prayer point I've raised. Do you know at times you have some terrible dream? Then when they push you for dream, you can come wake up like this. Some of us teachers say, maybe not ordinary. I tell not be ordinary. 
If God should open your eye in the realm of the spirit, what did they intend against you? So that time when they eat, with they drink in the dream. We said, not just ordinary, not lie. Have you not watched most of the time some dream when you dream, I call the main manifest. If it was ordinary, why be say, why, why be say it can't, it can't actually happen the way you dream, see? Because what it does, we go in the realm of the spirit. God, that is why we are praying to that. I say, God, trouble them that trouble me. Trouble them that trouble me. Spare them or see. In as well, I continue to spare the wicked. I continue to trouble you. May we not be troubled in Jesus' name. Amen. So that is why when they are saying, pray against the wicked, not close your mouth. Not close your mouth. Your best friend can be your worst enemy. We live mm -hmm. in a terrible world. The Bible mm -hmm. says in the book of 1 John chapter 5, verse 19, I think that it was last week or uh, last mm -hmm. few years that he read it for us some days ago. He says that what we know we are of God, but the whole world lies in wickedness. Mm -hmm. The whole world lies in wickedness. It is a part of the world. It is a half of the world. The entire world lies in wickedness, my people. So when they are saying pray against the voices of the wicked, pray the only language they will understand is violence. Mm -hmm. He said they violate the candy by four. You smell with the devil, you need to run fondle you. Mm -hmm. You take out, you become a guy with him, knows that well, you are not much for him. So we're going to pray that prayer again and say, Lord, trouble them that trouble me. First, it's whether from my father's house, whether from my mother's house, whether mm -hmm. from a friend that don't care who to know. Who's I not go get peace? He not go get peace. Go I'm going to pray. Lord, trouble them that trouble, the trouble them. Spare not, 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 not the wicked for my sake. Spare not the wicked for my sake. Yes, spare them not for my sake. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. In as much as God Goliath was around to trouble Lord God the children of Israel, Lord God, there was no way David could climb the throne. And so, therefore, I bring that every Goliath on my way. And on the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, yes, God, bring the man assign to that throne of God, my place of glory, my place of exaltation, my place of favor. And on the name of Jesus Christ, this season, Lord God, will not pass you by. But that from God, without receiving your divine visitation, and on the name of Jesus Christ, Rabba Soto. Trouble them that trouble me, Lord. Lord, God, trouble them that trouble me, Lord. Is in the night they will come over, come on my behalf. Is it not going to take all of you in a book like defend my cause, Lord? Defend my cause, Lord. Defend the cause of your people, Lord. In the name of Jesus Christ, Father, Lord, your king of the spend not the weekend. For our sake, Lord, your king of the day. And love is enough of this oppression. The Bible says we are coming to our head from nowhere. We are crying out to you, Lord, don't let everything. We are still praying, I'm angry in my spirit. You never hear story of people, young children, they lose their mama, she's an ordinary. You just don't say this one get cancer. This one get, because they don't work that matter for night. They don't work that matter for, for, for night. So that that's your content to sickness on in, in the day, whereas not life. You see people suffering, they are not supposed to suffer. Are you not tired? You labor so hard at the end of the day, nothing to show for it. This is the beginning of New Year because the wicked, you know, one thing they get the wicked does. When they not say they not fear, they go afflict those around you who are mm. saying, mm. you go begin to spend unnecessary for their case. Because you mm. say your brother, they suffer, your sister, they suffer. You go get that money, you go keep her. You go want mm. her. And now the two that means they'll come begin to withdraw from you. That's mm. what we are calling trouble. Trouble, the wicked. They are so wicked, they have no mercy. In okay. the kingdom of darkness, there is no mercy. Oh. Mercy is out of the other, so we will not have mercy on them. So we want to pray this time around. I want, I want to leave you to pray. Look into your life. What is that that they have been using to trouble you? I want to address that thing by name. But I'm not you need to call them by name. Address them by name. Bible said the mention of the name of Jesus. Every name was back. Yes, they said any name, any name I bet above every name they must come. So sickness is a name. Sickness, diabetes is a name. I blood pressure is a name. Oh, yes, my, uh, my husband is, a, is sick, is a name. Whatsoever it might be. No fruit of the womb is a name. Open your mouth, address your case. I need you to pray. Open your mouth, address that case. I want to hear you praying. You have come to the altar of solution. I tell you, you are the greatest prophet to yourself. That is why I always tell my people. I will pray for you. It will not be like the prayer you pray for yourself. Address that situation by yourself. Oh, men that they carry, men that they leave you alone. 
Hey, Father, this is not the body they can dwell in. Your money, yes, they are kept out in the north. Hey, Masoto, you can't have a soto. Ragada, you can't have a soto, you can't have a soto. Hey, no name of Jesus, because I am in the image of God. Hey, nobody, yes, you go play with God and go scot free. And so, therefore, because I'm in the image of my Father, no weapon of fashion against me will prosper. That is what my Bible tells me. Yes, they will fashion, but they will not prosper. They will not prevail. My Bible tells me, surely they shall gather. He never told me they will not gather. But yes, one of us, God's not for him, they scatter. And so every gang up of the weekend against my case, Father, Lord, God scattering. Confusion in the name of Jesus. Go ask after that. For my case, is talking of glory. Let them be confused. 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 Let every one of them. In the name of Jesus. Each one they raise my issue. In the Lord, they pick up the evil word. Confusion among them in the name of Jesus. They begin to know this one is a different person entirely. Hey, my soto, I am untouchable in the name of Jesus. My family is untouchable in the name of Jesus. My children they are untouchable in the name of Jesus. Hey, my soto, you are not going to be able to get out of here. Oh, my God, 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 my my guess is the friend. I bear my body, the mark of Jesus. That's the touch not, touch not. Because my Bible says, touch not my mother that do my prophet to me. Hey, my name of Jesus. Rabba koso, regele ba 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 koso, regele Another thing that delivered this woman is that she found up on time. Have you not seen some people? You say, ah, if you have come five minutes ago, I would have helped you. Mm. Ah, if we have come to meet her, she would have died 10 minutes ago. Ah, it was when we were just stepping, stepping him. Or oh, maybe as they were just rushing out to the hospital, that was when she gave up the ghost. I mm. want to pray. And says, God, my help, Lord, I ask for help, and they must come on time. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. They must come on time, not just mm -hmm. asking that my airport should meet me at the point of my knees. Repeat mm -hmm. after me, say, my father, my father. 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 I ask for your divine help. I ask for your divine help. And I ask for my effort to come on time. I ask for my effort to come on time. I ask for my effort to come on time. Hey, let me explain this, what I mean by you. Before you pray this way, hold on. Do you know there are some people that are married to the wrong people today? Ah, oh, because he don't wait for the right man, wait for the right man, not see. Now I go jump with Mr. John, but we're not supposed to jump. Now I go tell, now the woman, the man goes jump with me and, and Mr. John, like we're not supposed to jump. And today the marriage is still a problem because he waited and waited. Not be say before to, not be say be just let the baby wait. Or tell the baby, wait. But because he you not know, come on time. Hey, I, I, do you know what, what, we, what we talk about time? What, what, what am I trying to say here? Have you ever missed play? Oh, you are about to miss not the race. If you have been to the airport, not the race where people they will want miss play with the, the because they know if they miss a, a grip, it will start all over again. Do you know that's how people have started over? Nobody said no, be said, be not wait, but because he could no longer wait and say time. So far, me will marry. So far, me they come in general, don't marry. So far, make a bump, he cannot feel wait again, and they fell into the way they're not supposed to be. So it's every aspect of life. No, I just marriage as an example. Every aspect of life. You know, you pray when you don't suffer something, you will not be reduced. Because in, 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 I've been on my level. I've been on my level. Now, situation can't bring me down to this level. Why? Because you have waited and not, the effort was not forthcoming. So we're going to pray that prayer and say, my father, my father. 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 I ask for your divine help. I ask for your divine help. And Lord, let my effort let my, let come on time. Come on time. Open the mouth and pray. When I call out the odds, I get value. When I call out the odds, I get value. My effort must come on time. He must Come on, time. Okay. They must locate me on time. In the name of Jesus Christ, I have to your divine help. I have to talk to your divine help, Lord. Your divine help, Lord. Help me, Lord. Help me, Lord. This woman was talking of very Jesus. Father, yes, if she has not met you on time, she would have died in a bloody condition. But Lord God, she met you on time. There was an encounter of time. Like, Father, timely encounter. Timely encounter. Let her be my situation in the name of Jesus. Father, 
you know my, my people we have a say in our place and says that what i will say i uh, i will say yes they do you know that they do good for we are good for the switch what do they mean by that I say now you get all near here. For those that does not understand, Benny, that they do good for we are busy that they appreciate our own. Now the good way they do on time, now that they appreciate. Remember, you know, Mary and Mary, they told Jesus and say, if you have been here on time, George at you say, my uh, brother would not have died. Lazarus would not have died. Mm -hmm. Now they are telling you, say, Jesus, you came, but it was no right way, no fool. It would not, he would not have died. And you know, see, let me quickly share this story. I'll just cut it off because of time. Some of you have heard me say, say it, you know, it time passed. There was a lady, a true life story. It was in fact my, my pastor's wife that told me this story years ago. And I've been praying that prayer for my life. What happened? This lady was doing enough for marriage because she was a bino. You know, these days now, when people have been on our show, those they have been on business, I say, are abomination. I say, apple for their village. This lady don't reach to, to marry, you know, see husband. In fact, I fire prayer for their church. Now pray anything that is when they're quiet, they pray about their everything. If they wait for Mr. Right, Mr. Right, not Greek, pray, pray. People will come in time for the church, they go to marry, they go. Until finally, this lady come wake up in my Anybody will come, he go marry her. Now I go end up, go marry her, one allergy, a second or third wife then. I see my, no, no, I said, God, don't the trouble one brother. Me, I said that, that village, that church, where God let us. You got south for Lagos, got the trouble, and that was the problem life matter. Say, your wife now, so so sister, so so so. Let them maybe this lady have been on a lesson. I'm well, maybe sister Kate. Sister Kate, they have your divine wife. Why I don't order for you? He said, uh, with the, uh, uh, oh God, Jesus, now, uh, sister Kate, now, been one of you, Maria, been Because if I might have been at the end of the day, Michelle say, my one of one or two of my children will be, I've been, I've been at the end of the day. No, enough of you where you know, watch a, 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 a generation of Abino to call the long story short. Now, so God trouble the, 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 the brother trouble trouble. When we like start, they pray, pray, pray for village. Finally, come say, make it go village. Before it go village, the sister already don't marry a second or third wife to one allergy. And when he reached here now, it was in an hour proposed to sister. He can't be not come, he can't, but it was, it was too late. Mm. It was too late. So when we are praying for timely intervention, Timely intervention is very, very important. A, a woman giving birth at the age of 60, when they sit on the internet, it's good that sitting birth at the age of 60 or 70, good. But which I want to take up that picking? Let's face reality. Hey, yes, uh, go on, Sammy. You debut upstairs, you know, as that we used to say, you debut at the age of 80. Which year you want to, which leg you want to climb the step? And what <laughs> by God bless you, and what by jet? You come by jet at the age of 90. I want to enter. I said, yo, you know, say, they want to take us, they go back. I said, you go back. Go, 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 go. <laughs> so the person go, might go fly for inside the place. <laughs> he don't have to be that. Praise the Lord. May that not be our case in Jesus' name. Amen. Mm -hmm. So we are going to pray that prayer for the guy. Say, God, timely intervention concerning that matter. I don't mm -hmm. know what is your situation. Lord, yeah, make it not to delay again. Father, timely intervention. Intervene timely on my case. Open your mouth and pray. Oh. Intervene timely on my case. I need the answer now, Lord. I am not asking too much. It is my it is my right. Ah, Lord, God, I need the answer now. Hey, Master Galavaso, the Basso, Rakalavaso. No, my boy, yes, I said that. I make an I make an I must send them. I must say, my own best. Okay, no. Okay, no. Yes, I'm wrong. What I must say, I can you go up on 
Anu Mosema, who that way you are Yaya Lago down there? Open your mouth and pray. Eh, timely intervention, timely intervention, timely intervention. Masanda Yababa Soto, Father, not talking of the timely intervention, timely intervention, intervene in my case, intervene in my case, intervene in my case, intervene in my case, Lord. Let me turn around, Lord. Eh, not talking of glory, I need it now, I need it now. Father, timely intervention, timely intervention. Timely intervention. Timely intervention. Timely intervention. Timely intervention. Timely intervention. In the mother name of Jesus Christ. In Jesus' name. In the name of Jesus. We are going to a close, don't worry. And I want to add tonight one of the way God can intervene timely. Why well, will not give up is that you knowing God? We want to add this prayer and say, repeat after you say, My father, my father. My father, my father. My father, my father. My father, my father. Help me to know you more and more. Help me to know you more and more. Help me to know you more and more. Help me to know you more. I tell you, that is the secret to everything we have been saying. Please open your mouth. I want to know you, Jesus. I want to know, I want to know, I want to know. I want to know your word. I want to spend time in your prayers. If you can do this on your own, you will conquer. Open your mouth. I want to know you more and more. More of you, Lord. 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 More of you, Lord, in my life. In my life, let your king of glory. Hey, if I know you more and more, yes, you go king of life. Walk righteously in your way. The devil cannot temper with me, Lord God, neither than anything that belongs to me. My father, Lord God, if I know you more and more, Lord God, will know the right thing to do at the right time. My father, what belongs to me, Lord God, will not be delayed. Even when it's delayed, Lord God, king of life, could be for my own good at the end of the day. My father, the best will know you more and more. Thank you, Lord. We give a praise. In Jesus' name, we are praying. Amen. God bless you. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. We are taking the Holy Communion. Amen. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Please let's open our Bible first, Corinthians of our level. If you are there, quickly read for us from verse 23. Well, that is our custom. First Corinthians of the level, verse 23 says. Yes, For I have received of the Lord that which also I deliver unto you, that the Lord Jesus, the same night in which he was betrayed, took bread. And when he had given thanks, he broke it and said, Take it, this is my body which is broken for you. This do in remembrance of me. After the same manner also he took the cup. When he had supped, saying, This cup is the new testament in my blood. These two years as often as ye drink it in remembrance of me. For as often as ye eat this bread and drink this cup, ye do show the Lord's death till he come. Wherefore, whosoever shall eat of this eat this bread and drink this cup of the Lord unworthily shall be guilty of the body and the blood of the Lord. But let a man examine himself, and so let him eat of that bread and drink of that cup. Amen. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Amen. You know, our custom quickly, one or two words, just talk to God. Lord, have mercy on me anywhere I might have heard, so that this will not turn against me, rather to my favor. Open your mouth and pray. As you ask God for mercy, I want you to talk to God also. What do you want the only communion to do in your life? He, has, he can bring healing. He can bring direction. He can give strength. Open your mouth and talk to God. Father, in the name of Jesus Christ, Lord God, we thank you. We thank you. As your people ask God, let there be a release of honor in the name of Jesus Christ. Thank you, Lord God, for all this. Thank you for healing. Thank you for deliverance. Thank you for strength. As we take this to God in unity tonight, Lord, in the mother name of Jesus Christ. Thank you, Lord. In Jesus' name. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Our Father and our God, I give a praise. Concerning Lord God, the solid there represented, Father, the bread there representing your body. As Lord, your people take it. I ask allness upon them in the name of Jesus. Amen. Healing Amen. to the sick in the name of Jesus. Praying to the weak in Jesus' name. Amen. Thank you, Lord. In as much as we obey you, Lord, honor your word in our lives. That this Amen. will turn to a blessing to us in Amen. Jesus' name. Amen. Please take it. The blood of Jesus. Oh, As you're taking this piece here for the entire family. The blood of Jesus set me free. The blood of Jesus. The blood of Jesus set me free. From sin and sorrow. The Lord of Jesus, in Jesus' name, Amen. Our Father, Lord God, will bring before you the wine, 
representing Amen. your blood that was shed on the cross. Amen. Lord, we have obeyed you. We are asking, Amen. Lord, do that which you need to do in our lives through this Amen. strength in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. The strength of the weak in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. Lord, encouragement to discourage in Jesus' name. Amen. That body that is sick Amen. receive healing in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. To continue this fasting and prayers, you will not Amen. be weary along the way in the name of Jesus. Amen. I'm happy to tell Lord God we are believing you for signs and wonders. Lord Amen. God, revelation this period. I command Amen. every eye that be see spiritually be open. You Amen. that used to dream and now you no longer dream, I ask those eyes will open in the name Amen. of Jesus. Amen. All your dream is not this that you no longer get it clear. I command Amen. those eyes begin to open and grace to remember and Amen. grace to interpret rightly in the name of Jesus Amen. Christ. Amen. Oh, yes, and the of strength upon you, grace will be able to fight even in the dream and you'll be an overcomer in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. In Amen. Jesus' name we pray. Amen. 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 Please take it and as you take it, God bless you. Amen. Jesus. Begin to thank God. Open your mouth. Begin to thank God. Thank you. Glorify. Thank God for the holy communion. Thank God for today's fasting and prayers. Let's just thank God for the grace He has given to us to wait upon Him till now. Thank you, Father, for everything. Where's God? Let's have your holy name. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you. In Jesus' name, we have given thanks. Amen. Amen. God bless you all. Oh, we are calling it uh, uh, um, a day today. I want to say thank you for making yourself available. Despite uh, our so much busy schedule, we went to church this is morning and we left church uh, this afternoon. We are here again. I say your labor will not be in vain, Jesus. name. Amen. So just tell me and God not will answer us. Upon all this labor, all this wahala, and God is not that wicked at mm -hmm. all. He's a faithful father. If not for any other thing, he will choose to have mercy. For this, our labor of love. And God Amen. will bless you in Jesus' name. Amen. So please remember tomorrow the fasting continue. And on Friday also, sorry, in the evening by 5 o'clock tomorrow, please remember to log in. Amen. Let's share the Amen. grace. May Amen. the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, Christ. Christ. Love. The, love the love of God, God. and the sea blood from the Holy Spirit rest on our back with us now and forever. forevermore. Amen. 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 Surely, God's goodness and mercy shall follow us all the days of our life, and we shall dwell in the house of the Lord forever and ever. Amen. Thank you. Tomorrow, 5 o'clock, invite others. God bless you. Ciao. Bye.